Right, let's see if this works better. I've tried to do this video a couple of times, but it's not worked out. So I'm going to try it one last time. Um, what you're going to need, oops, get rid of that. What you're going to need to run this mod is Flans Planes mod. If you search for Flans mods on Minecraft forums, you should come to this page, and it's got all of his mods listed here. What you're going to need is Mod Loader MP client, Turbo Model thingy client, and Planes client. Once you have all of those downloaded, as I do here already, you can go to your Minecraft folder, which is, if you can't find it, dollar app date, um, percent app data, percent, and then Minecraft and bin. In here you will have Minecraft.jar. Now if you right click, you can open this with run WinRAR if you have that installed. If you don't, you can rename the extension to dot zip and Windows inbuilt zip manager I think will load it in whatever interface that uses. That brings up the contents of that file. What you need to do now is you're going to need mod loader MP, open that up and it's got all of these files in it. You're going to need to drag all of these to there. Then do the same with turbo model thingy. And drag all of them to there. And then, if you open up Planes itself, it has several different files in there. The JAR files one, you will need to select all of that again and drag all into there, and that's absolutely fine. Then you have Resources. If you go back to your Minecraft folder, you have a Resources folder in there, and if you drag everything from in here into there, it will. It won't ask you to overwrite because I've already got them there. Um, it will copy across all the sounds you need for the planes mod. Last but not least, the planes.txt file. Now you just copy that straight to the root of .minecraft, and it will be here. Now the thing is, if you don't have this file here, it may sound silly, but it lists all the planes. If you don't have this txt file here, then um, it's only going to let you craft one plane for some reason. I'm not sure why. Oh, one last thing. You need to rename. If you've renamed this, you need to rename it back to .jar. And then it should run fine. <coughs> it may take a second because I'm using the graphics pack. So it takes longer to load than usual. That's a fair exchange. Come on, you slow thing. There we go. Now, the thing to note is if you've got planes installed, you can join single player servers, I mean, normal servers without issue, even if they don't have planes running. Give us a second to load. So I now have planes installed, but it doesn't matter because the server doesn't, so I can still play absolutely like normally. You can get access to planes on single player though. If you have um, if you have admin access or you craft the items or if you have this wonderful add-on called uh, too many items, you can get yourself any of the planes you wish straight here, straight in single player. Very useful little program. As you can see I've made a few already and sit in them and fly around and have lots of fun. I'll try this, but I don't have a big enough runway at the moment and I keep crashing and exploding, hence all the parts in here. So yeah, hopefully that's good enough for you guys. Once we get planes running on the server, you guys will be able to join in and play. Have fun.